um, you need you need not to rest. You cannot rest. That history is a way to justify the preservation. Yeah. Okay, so because that's you, not a good. You, you, you should say it's historic. We know what was there. We might find space to put up a sign about what was there. Right. Uh, show the dig, etc. But. You know, it's not significant enough or unique enough. To, yeah, to. that's right. I mean, Miles Carey's home, Rich Deck, they built a school on it. Now they did do archaeology and everything like that, but once they had that, they just checked it off. And, yeah. yeah, they took pictures. They found objects, but there was, you know, there. Miles Carey is an important person in 17th century history here, but he's not gonna, you know, he's not like. Uh, uh, well, let's just say Nathaniel Bacon, or uh, uh, so forth. So you really have to, preservation is so difficult to do, that you really have to look at the value of the resource from an educational um, part and uh, learning and heritage stores of aspect, and how can you therefore make it work. You, know, you don't have those things okay. at River. So it could be just a little minor thing. There. Well, you, the best thing you little can get thing. is a sign. Yeah. You know, okay. and, and I hate to say that. Right. Okay. Because I, you know, I've preserved a lot of buildings sure. in sure. Newport News, and I really believe in it. But well, that's that's not a fight you're going to win. Okay. Well, the main, so it's mostly the, green the space. Right. Yeah. We're thinking of waterfront it's green actually, space. Yeah. It's not just. And, and you can get a sign. It's not just 